Well, today is the last day I'll be in New England. Uh, tonight is the fun travel start. Uh, but first we've got to go, uh, the guy who takes care of our cat, uh, he just came back, but we offered if he needed anything. So he wanted some cheeses. So we're headed out to get some cheeses. What else we got to get? A little box of wine for some chicken noodles, some chicken rice soup, and jellies and jams for you to carry. Oh, yeah. Some bacon chili. What is it? Bacon chili? chili. Spicy bacon chili? I don't know. We'll see it when we see it. <laughs> No, I just realized something. In this car, I'm on the left-hand side. When we're in Eleuthera, I'm on the right-hand side, Sid's on the left. And it's easier for me in Eleuthera because I'm over there to shine the phone like this than this way. Uh, because it Your just- Your wrist gets in the way. Right, my wrist <laughs> is sort of in the way. <laughs> oh, I guess we're having a horsey thing here. And yes, my cold thing is still hanging on. Should make for an interesting flying day. It's nothing like having a puffy head while you get on an airplane that's pressurized. You gotta bring gum. Yeah. And earphones. Oh, I always bring earphones. That's not a problem. Uh, but oh, and then probably about Friday morning it'll be fine. <laughs> it's all gone. <laughs> over there, right? Like you can't chop up your own peppers and onions? Yeah, so that way you don't have to buy the ones, chop them up. They come all done for you. So. Buy your roasted, right. Right, so you need fire roasted. And somebody's losing a lot of money because red peppers are expensive. Somebody does this in the living room, they'll make a fortune. Okay, we got uh, cheeses to bring down for that friend of ours. And then we got a little pack of mozzarella, because we're going to go try to find after on the way back. Uh, there's a farm, and hopefully they have uh, heirloom tomatoes, which would be like a brandy wine, which is a big, fat, juicy, really good tomato, with uh, a slice of mozzarella on top. You got basil? Yeah. Okay, with basil. It's really good. Uh, next is Stole gas. Kitchen. No, we're going to get gas. Nope, gas. That one, is gas is over there. Oh, gas the is easier. One. Yeah. Yeah. The Milton one is yeah, gas next. I think they need to redo the uh, main sign up there, huh? Hmm. A little shabby. Okay, grocery shopping's done. What do we got? One more stuff? Off to the farm place? Yes. Yeah. See if we can get a uh, uh, nice, tomato. nice tomato. If not. Important word is nice tomato. Right. A nice tomato. Not a nice hard rock tomato. A really good, fresh, local, ripe, preferable heirloom. Heirloom, like a brandy wine or something. Tons of flavor. 
Nope. Nope, still not open. I think they'll be open when I come back. Nope. <laughs> yeah, by the time I come back, let's see, the trees will all be bear. leafless, bare. Um, I'm not quite sure when that's going to be. Maybe late October, maybe the beginning of November. A lot depends on what's happening, at what stage uh, the project down in Eleuthera is doing. Um, so I'll, I'll have a better feel for that in the next couple weeks of where we're going to be. So then I can make plans as to uh, when I'm coming back and then ooh, suicide Just as well. made it. Made it. Um, then I'll uh, come back spend a little time here, pick up Sid, and then we'll uh, go back to Eleuthera. I can't foresee any other reason coming back before Christmas after that. Selling wine and booze and hmm. those clouds you just saw, that's part of a cold front that's coming. Yesterday was cooler. Today is probably in the 70s, pretty humid. Uh, and so this cold front's coming up. And I just heard from my sister. Her husband flew in from uh, Texas and all the flights were messed up because of this impending storm or something. So he got himself to Boston and now he's got a bus, train, rent a car to get back to Maine. I'm hoping, my flight still says it's on time. I've got to get up tonight around 1, 1.30, leave here around 2.30 uh, to get the bus and then the bus to Boston, and hopefully there's no delays because otherwise if tomorrow gets messed up, I've got a bit of a window from Nassau to Eleuthera, but only a couple hours worth. So it's one of those we're gonna have to wait and see what happens. Today's pretty much done. Trip's pretty much done back to New England. Um, got a few little things to do, a little bit more packing because I don't want to do any packing at one o'clock tonight. So tomorrow, get up around 1, 1.30, bus ride, plane ride, wait. Hopefully there's no delays. Get back to Eleuthera. Get up and see what the guys have done.